But first up this morning, we are headed under the sea. The Little Mermaid is playing now at the Fifth Avenue Theater until Sunday, October 8th. And lucky for us, we have them in studio this morning. Well, specifically in our kitchen. Here is Jason Whitecamp playing Chef Louis from The Little Mermaid. Bonjour. I am Chef Louis. Oh, please come to my restaurant at the Fifth Avenue Theater. Oh, it will be a delight to have you. Oh, Wednesday through Sunday, please come. Les poissons, les poissons. How I love les poissons. Let you jump and serve the fish. First I cut off the head, then I pull out the bones. I may we sauce it toujours delicious. Les poissons, les poissons. <laughs> ha, ha. With a cleaver, I hack them in two. I pull out what's inside and I serve it up fried. God, I love little fishes, don't you? Here's something for tempting the palate. Prepared in the classic technique. First you pop the fish flat with a mallet. Then you slice with the skin, give the belly a slice, then you rub some salt in. <laughs> Cause that makes it taste nice. <gasps> so, hello, I have missed one. Oh, sacre bleu. What is this? How on earth could I miss such a sweet little succulent crab? Kelly Dimash, what a loss! You belong in the sauce with some flour, I think, just a dab. Then I'll stuff you with bread. It won't hurt. You'll be dead, and you'll surely be lucky you are. Cause it's gonna be hot <laughs> in my big copper pot. To the Lou Montpensant, or ever. That was amazing. <laughs> That is my favorite, absolute favorite song from The Little Mermaid. Oh, thanks. It is the funniest <laughs> song. It is so good. I love how how much you get into character. How what was it like getting into character for this role? Um, you know, it is, I'm not much of a cooker, <laughs> and so uh, it's fun to sort of play around in the kitchen and just have fun and mm -hmm. just go crazy. Um, in the show, I have these props that are just like outrageous, and they I just are. get to play with them and beat. There's so many nicks and crannies on this uh, table that I hit that I've made some definite dents. <laughs> the first couple times, I definitely um, I did cut myself a couple oh, times. Oh no. That's fine. That's fine. All for the. <laughs> <laughs> my um, I actually saw the show last Wednesday and I thought it was amazing. It was absolutely so much fun because you've seen the animated version. And so, of course, when it comes to putting it on stage, it's not going to be the same. But the way you all thought about everything is brilliant. I especially love the part where your you and your staff get trapped under this table that you were talking about, I think, banging things. And it's just... It is hilarious. It is such a beautiful thing. Tell us your what you think of the show. Um, I love it. Um, Little Mermaid was always my favorite growing up. Um, I used to actually want to be an animator at one point, oh, wow. and Little Mermaid sort of pr helped me propel me into that that idea. Um, but I just I. I love this show because there's so much nostalgia to it, yes. especially for myself growing yes. up with it. Um, but then, like, there's so much magic and new stuff to it that mm -hmm. keeps it interesting and exciting. Um, that I just and I, this company is absolutely wonderful. Oh, there's such a beautiful a team of people that so put together. So talented. Uh, I did love the fact that there were separate things that were different from the movie. The sisters are more featured. There's different songs. It's it's just beautiful. What is your favorite song of the play? Other than yours, of course. Of, of course. Um, I would probably say Kiss the Girl. Oh, and, and, they do know, a great job with that. It's such a beautiful song. We're, and we're backstage singing um, the backup to it while they're all on stage in the in the lagoon. And it's, it's just such a beautiful, like, kind of haunting, but beautiful. And yeah. it's all about, like, propelling them to kiss and just really, like, fall in love. And it's Aww, so beautiful. I love that. What do you hope families take away when they see the show? Oh, um... You know, the sense of 
independence and also like family and mm -hmm. the the love you have for your family and the love you have for your kids growing up and mm -hmm. letting go but also supporting them in everything they're doing it's it's so true because when i remember seeing little mermaid of course when we're young we identify with the rebellious young mermaid <laughs> but now that i'm a parent i'm like that little girl did not listen so but it did actually remind me as i walked away from the show to, to let my children live a little and to, to trust them. So I have to say thank you so much of course. for getting up this morning early and sharing <laughs> your talent with us and to our maestro as well. Thank you. The Little Mermaid is playing at the Fifth Avenue Theater for just a few more days until Sunday, October 8th. My friends, go check it out. You're going to love it. Head to their website for ticket details.